Hey, how's it going there, guys? Center Stalker here for a video. In this video right here, I'm just going to do a bunch of little things around town. But first off, I'm going to hit up this thrift shop behind me, see if there's any tapes up in that piece or anything kind of cool and retro like that. And I might hit another one up after that, possibly. And towards the end of this video, I have a couple movie reviews from Arrow Video for you guys to check out. Just a couple quick ones. And later on, I might have a concert, so I might take you guys with me to check that out. That'd be kind of cool. A cool show in town. Nice dead metal show. So uh, this little hint right there, what it might be, death metal show. I'll, I'll show you guys later what it what it is, of course, when I go. And then after that, who knows what else around town? So let's get down with this little stock and adventure and go up in here. Spot of the day on this cold and cloudy day in SD is a uh, Team Ambit. We go in there, been there in like um, yeah, maybe a few months or so. Must have like a big bin of uh, tapes. Usually it's sometimes like, eh, whatever, but I mean, you know what, I might as well just chuck it out in the area. Let's go see, and let's go up this ramp. I'm sure you guys seen this in the videos. A couple, few times I've been here in videos and showed it, so uh, hopefully they have something at least cool to pick up. All right, so here's like the first place I went to is the, the bin of tapes. It looks like it might just be a bunch of um, <laughs> whatever, kind of like uh, garbage tapes it might be. Maybe you might find something, but it looks like it might be just a bunch of weird, stupid stuff with, with some German wires in there, the stuff I don't really need, but I'm gonna look. I'm gonna see if I see something cool. I'll let you know what it looks like so far. A whole lot of nada. Not a dang thing in the tapes, just a bunch of garbage. So now I'm over here by the books next to the books are the DVDs, so maybe, maybe something there. The reason why I've not been here in a few months is because they have nothing in here. <laughs> so I might not even come back here, at least for a long, long time, because so far I'm seeing nothing much. I'm gonna look at this a little more thoroughly. If I see anything cool or anything kind of unusual, I'll show you guys. But so far, it looks like it's a bunch of common titles and just things like I just don't need. Just looking around, I see this weird Haley Joel Osment movie, the one I never heard of, called The Ransom Red Chief. The Ransom of Red Chief. Looks like a real low budget one with Christopher Lloyd in it. I'm not going to get this, but it looks like a real strange, weird one. Like, look at Christopher Lloyd right there. I don't know what this even is. Ever heard of it? Must be like one of his first movies or something like that, you know, possibly I would say um, right in there. I don't know. But yeah, right there. So this left Team Ambeds and absolutely zilch nada in there. Pretty disappointing. That's probably why I haven't been there in a long time. The place is, is crap. So off to some real. Now back home because I realized I got to do a quick little beard trim in lineup for tonight. I want to get out of the way right now. So I'm going to do that real quick. So when I come back, this will be a little bit trimmed up in a way. Here we go. Whoa, just like that, it's all trimmed up right there. You know if you can see a little bit better. But boom, a little bit trimmed up. Like, you know, I was wearing some kickback stuff right now because I might be going somewhere else. Maybe the gym, if you want to join me at the gym. Boom, so now I'm over here at the gym over at LA Fitness doing, uh, you know, one arm, because I'm recording, so I'm doing the one arm thing, you know what I mean? Little free motion chest weights. So I'm just doing this right now, and then after this, Go some other places. Get my pump on. Bah, bam. All right. So right now, you can see I'm not at the house. I'm at this place called the Observatory here at North Park with my girl Deanna. She's over in the other room right now. He's in the ladies' room. Checking out Morbid Angel. Headline is Cannibal Corpse, the classic death metal band, Cannibal Corpse. A little bit dark up in here. Cause it goes to the bar right up over there. The band's playing right now. I'm gonna go back and I'll show you some footage of it. Some of the merch, and then from there, she got some Cannibal Corpse. And watch out for my movie reviews, too. But we're over there right now. Pretty busy up in here right now. I'm not sure the light is on this thing, but the band's like playing. Like right over here, you can see like the band's playing like right over there. There is Deanna. She's right up there. Deanna. There you go. There you go. We came from the upstairs. Huh? We came from the upstairs. Yes. I think I think the pro I think it's done. I think we missed it. Huh? I, think, I think we missed the finale. Oh, we did. It's okay. It's okay. I think we did. Yeah, it's all, it's all good though. It's all good. Cause you got cannibal corpse. Like, I, I thought you were saying we made it. No, 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 no. We, well, we, we missed the finale of. Morbid Angel. Oh, okay. We got Campbell Corpse coming next. It's funny about Campbell Corpse. It's the very first death metal show I've ever seen was yeah. Campbell Corpse. Right. When I turned 21, I see Campbell Corpse. This is your first time seeing Campbell Corpse. Huh? 
This is your first time seeing Cannibal Corpse. Yeah. It's going to be pretty cool. Really good live. So now, hey, hey, probably more beer. So we've already had a beer, more beer, show some merch, oh, things okay. like that. And uh, it's kind of hectic. Right? Yeah, Holy yeah. crap, I'm like this. There are beers right there. We got the CBR, we got the Modena. Movie review time right about now. Movie review portion of the video. These two titles here from Arrow Video. A couple cool releases just came out. First off, I'm going to start with this classic from The Godfather of Gore, Herschel Gordon Lewis. The final of the Blood Trilogy is this one. Color Me Blood Red. An awesome Blu-ray, high definition quality. Cool, you know, cult B-movie gold is this one. The story takes place as this painter named Adam Sorge. He's kind of in a bit of a little artistic bind. He's like, well, he's kind of trying to think what to do with his next artistic abilities to paint. And But one day his girlfriend accidentally cuts her finger and he sees the blood and how he sees it, you know, it uh, transpires on the canvas and he realizes, you know what? What I need for my paintings is human blood and gore to go with my artworks. So he starts do delving into that world of trying to get blood for his art pieces and that kind of a thing and it's cool interesting in this really cool fun you know classic of gore goodness back in the day style from the 60s is color me blood red a lot of good features this thing i'll show you right now there's a whole bunch of them up here you got a commentary you get some retrospect hg lewis uh you know introductions all kinds of good stuff you know a really cool commentary with hg lewis on there he's passed away now but you got a really cool like retro one of that all kinds of good stuff in this right here in this good set you also get the classic um, reversible cover art in this thing, so you want the old cover, but here's the new commission stuff. Really good stuff here, good classic one to have to the collection. All right, next here, but also from Arrow Video, is this one cool giallo classic called The Possessed. It's in black and white, but looks really great. Nice 2K restoration scan, this thing from Visual Film and Negative. My first time watching this, and it was really well made, I thought, really well done movie. Starting this novelist named Bernard. He's like, he has, he just wants to find out what happened to his old girlfriend, so he finds out she's at this hotel, she's working as a maid, he goes over there to see what's going on, he meets uh, the owner of the hotel and his daughter, but he finds out that the, his old girlfriend has like, disappeared, so he just wants to investigate what's going on, they can't, he doesn't know what happened, but while doing so, all this crazy stuff goes goes on, he gets involved with all these like, weird perversion things, all kinds of stuff going on, of who done it, and all kinds of weird stuff he gets plunged into, trying to find out what happened to his old flame in this one, The Possessed. A really cool movie made in the 60s, Really well done. Here's the back of it right up here. Get some commentary, some behind the scenes, some interviews with some of the actors and makeup artists and that kind of thing up here. And this cool 1960s, you know, giallo flick is this one, The Possessed. Really did well done. Like I said, some black and white. But looks really good in black and white. If you like black and white flicks and like older type style of movies, you'll definitely enjoy this one. All right, so that's it for the reviews. Couple of quick ones up there. So link down below, you can get these out, of course. Check these titles out more if you're interested. Link down below, like I said. And now back to the rest of the video. <laughs> Stay 
Burden in my pajamas. I'm representing the Mickey's Malt Liquor. Is my pajama top? That's how I do with some alien pajama bottoms. Oh yes, but a fun times. Me that I had at Campbell Corpse, Morbid Angel. Fun times. Kind of rainy outside. Kind of crap. So I don't record anything outside. But we're back home. Kind of late. Gonna go to bed in a bit. So if you guys enjoyed this video, if you guys did, give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment below. If you like those movies I reviewed right there. Check out the link down below for the Arrow video movies I talked about. It's a couple of cool ones if you guys like, if you guys like that. Check out that site and more. Until next time, we'll catch you later. Ooh, yeah. That's my crappy death metal voice. Okay, I'll see you then.